Hey Taurus. Let's do a soul path reading for Taurus for March. Let's see where your soul path is at the moment for March. Taurus's soul path. Well, two came out. So let's do them both. We got in Initiation and Scorpio. Initiation and Scorpio. Let's see. Here it is. Rebirth in spirit. A threshold has been crossed. The light within brightens. Transformation of the spirit self. The rites of passage for the soul. A conscious choice has been made. A testing period ended. New purpose within life and reality. The light dawns and shadows are scattered. So it sounds like kind of a, an awakening of some kind. And then Scorpio... Scorpio energy is dualism, the rising phoenix energies, feet planted firmly and the spirit soaring. You are ready to allow some issues to pass on. You renew by letting go. Energy flashes and spurts. Look at present situations from a new viewpoint. Time is ripe to weed the gar time is ripe to weed the garden and eliminate things that are no longer productive to your growth. So it looks like you're ready to set on some sort of a new path, Taurus. Some sort of a new path. We'll see. First card is spirit, and then we have air, water, earth, and fire. Let's see, where is your soul path at the moment? The valley. It's a very happy, joyous, calm, harmonious place. It's the easiest place to be. So if you've let go and are ready to start something new, you're in that you're in that peaceful point in the path right now. Then the air for air for your mind. There is a judge. You are it. If there is a judge, you are it. This reminds me of the judgment card. Maybe come into a new awareness. It's like you've decided something, made a decision. Almost like a refocus or a re... Judgment can also be a rebirth, literally. A re I mean, not literally, but can also mean rebirth. Let's see what the emotions in the water card. How to take care of yourself. Transmutation through union of op opposites. So, yeah, that's an again. That's like the. T this is kind of like the Temperance card. Another peaceful, harmonious card. In your emotions, that's a good place for this card. 
So you have a very balanced outlook, a very tempered outlook. Your emotions are tempered. Then in Earth, this is the day to day, the focus for your core. We have drug drag, which usually means um, well, as you can see here, he's just gotten to the top of this cliff. Like you've just surmounted some kind of huge optic obstacle and now you're weary. Maybe that's where this piece is coming from. It's just you've surmounted this op some sort of obstacle, come to some kind of new awareness in your mind. Just overcome something kind of big. So physically, you may be feeling weary. Emotionally, you're feeling peaceful. Your spirit is feeling peaceful. But physically, your body may be tired. And then the fire card, your desires, where your passions will lead. Raised consciousness, new awareness. So you're definitely passionate about something new, about becoming more aware. This lines right up with this judgment card. I really get the feeling that, at least in your soul path, you've recently gotten to a, you've risen to a different level, a higher, a higher level. You're, and this passion, this you could just be passionate about becoming more aware or perhaps even bringing awareness to some sort of an issue. This, this spread shows real growth, real growth on your soul path, Taurus. Having a raised consciousness, peace and harmony. Thanks, Taurus.